Simon Barnes, High Speed Sustainable Manufacturing Institute. Today I'm going to talk to you about technology readiness level, manufacturing readiness level and supply chain readiness level and how these three work together in synergy to explain some of our project ideas, engineering services and our commercial offering. So if we look at technology readiness level first, um, TRLs are traditionally done in universities. They start with the basic principles of something. They look for applications in industry or in business or at home, and then they experiment on those ideas. A validation process then leads through ultimately to a launch. This concept was really introduced by the Automotive Council a couple of years ago. Uh, what they added was manufacturing readiness level, because they saw an importance that when you're considering your technology, you need to think about how you make this technology, how you manufacture it. So they added stages in manufacturing from process, what process are you going to use, which materials, different technologies, coming up with a concept, the tooling, looking at costs, skills, and then through to initial production. And they looked at these two together and said, well, when you get to the technology readiness level three, you really need to be thinking about how you're going to manufacture this product. We've added supply chain readiness level because we think not only how you make the product, but what you make it from is important. So we're looking at the resilience of the raw materials, we're looking at how you map them, we're looking at assembly processes, sourcing, kitting, quality, and then evaluation. What we do here at HSSMI is we work from about technology readiness level three typically. Universities and our academic partners tend to do one, two, and three. We take over from there. And then we look at the new technologies, importantly how you manufacture it, so things like materials, tools, processes. And then we also look at the supply chain resilience or the value chain work. And we pull all of those together into a research programme, and that's typically what we do in our research. Further to the right, when we're looking at engineering services, we're then looking, perhaps we have a prototype already, we need to see how we tool to manufacture that prototype, how we will assemble it um, and what quality we want to deliver. So we'll typically look at that kind of area through engineering services projects. And then ultimately to the right again, when we're developing our own products as HSSMI Commercial, we'll be looking at how we manufacture them, but more importantly, how we sell them and evaluate and improve them as a sales item. So concept is technology readiness level, manufacturing and supply chain. Think about all three and where HSSMI can help you in the development of your new product or service. I think this is a really important concept and idea, and we find it very useful here, and we're always checking ourselves against it. So, for more information, you can email me simon.barnes at hssmi.org, or this is also on our website for you to have a look at and understand in more detail.